YouTube and welcome to a new video on my channel. Today is not an unboxing video but we do have an update for an existing watch, the Fossil Gen 6. This is actually the Fossil Gen 6 Razer Edition and this has just gone updated to the new Wear OS 3.0. So we could boot it up and we'll see the new boot for the Gen 6 Razer. You can still get the update for all of the other Gen 6s as well, as long as the Gen 6. You just need to force the update if you're not getting the update signal there yet, but effectively you could get that right now, today. So yeah, that's just booting up now. really boots quite quickly. So we'll just go through the quick setup and we'll do, we'll see a difference in, in here. Uh, yep, that shows that we now use the new Fossil Smartwatches app instead of the Wear OS app from previous Wear OS 2.0 watches. So since this has been updated from the older Wear OS 2.0 to the OS 3.0 there are slight differences and also major some major changes as well including that you are now using the Fossil Smartwatches app instead of the Wear OS app so you'd have to get used to using a different app it does seem like Google Fit has also been like pushed further behind the software now so Fossil ended up using their own wellness app. The Pixel Watch had the same issue where they're also not using Google Fit, but they are using Fitbit. As well for now, the Google Assistant is not available in this watch, but they have said that it will be coming later. And if you remember, even with the Galaxy Watch, the one with Wear OS, the first one with the Wear OS 3.0, it also did take a while to get the Google Assistant, but now we have it on the Galaxy Watch series. So at the moment, if you want an Assistant, you'll have to stick with Alexa for now, but the Google Assistant is coming. Swiping down, you still get quick settings. So you do get more quick settings on the board now. And to the proper settings, the layout is pretty similar and similar gestures. You can still have always on display. You can map the buttons on this one compared to the Pixel Watch where you can't. And if we look here, in about, this is the Fossil X Razor, of course, and Wear OS 3. Swiping from the sides is all your tiles, and it does seem like this time round it goes full circle, so it's not just all the way to one side or to the other. Meaning that if you swipe this way, it goes straight to a different screen, so all your tiles are still here. So there is no more quick access news and stuff. Swiping from the bottom, we do get all of the notifications. And yeah, the wellness app will be our new fitness. Changing the watch face is still the same as what we used to, just hold down on the home screen and you can just start getting more watch faces, add new watch faces, edit watch faces, but I do like the Razer Analog since it's, I did get the Razer edition of this watch. If you press the down the crown, we get to all of the apps. Similar to the Pixel Watch as well, where even the crown can be moved from side to side. 
like up and down to see all the apps. And of course, Google Pay has been changed with Google Wallet. And we'll have the wellness app for our fitness. The top button here is our quick settings. I mean, recent apps. So recent apps. And then double tap would go for your previous app that you had open. Similar to the Pixel Watch. The, the bottom button could be mapped to whatever you want it to be, so you could actually set that button to a different app. As well, at least for the Fossil Watch, you can actually customize the buttons. So I just set the top long press to launch Amazon Alexa since we don't have the Google Assistant. Middle bu button. Double tap would be the pay or the wallet and the bottom press is straight to the wellness app. If you do have a Fossil Gen 6 smartwatch, you still have to update it with the OS, the Wear OS app if you still have Android version 9 on the watch. So you still have to set it up if you have the older Gen 6 watches off the Wear OS app first and then you have to update it to the newer system on the watch itself. To update it you do have to go to the settings, I've already updated it so it's already like this. But if you're not getting the notification yet, just go to the update page and tap on the screen for about 30 seconds to about a minute and it will kind of force the update since the update is already available but it does take some time if you still want to wait but to force it stick on the screen and tap it for about 30 to 60 seconds to force the update but if you do get it quick there is a chance that you might have problems with the first batches of updates since sometimes there may be bugs if you don't want to update to the latest Wear OS 3.0, you can actually just stick to Wear OS 2.0 because the update does completely factory reset the watch itself. And I did also forget to mention that to get it to easily connect to the watch the next time around, you, you'll probably want to take it off your Bluetooth or like forget the device in the Bluetooth settings to do it as a fresh new setup for the watch. If you do buy a new Fossil Gen 6 watch like Razer or the other branded ones, you still do need to go through the face setup with Wear OS app for the Wear OS 2.0 before you could get the update to Wear OS 3.0 which will factory reset the watch again but yeah that's a bit unfortunate that you do have to go through that older process first but that's how it is for now for the existing Gen 6 watches right now the only Gen 6 smartwatch that you don't have to do that is if you get the newest Fossil Gen 6 Wellness Edition, which was just released the same day as the update. The only difference between the Fossil Gen 6 range and the Fossil Gen 6 Wellness Edition is mainly just a slightly different body and it's Wear OS 3.0 out of the box instead of Wear OS 2.0. So if you do want to get a new Gen 6 watch, you just maybe just go straight to the wellness edition but if you have an existing gen 6 smartwatch just get the update it's practically the same internals if you like this type of video please like comment subscribe i tend to do a lot of unboxings on my channel as well as a lot of collectibles and stuff so if you do enjoy these type of videos please subscribe comment in the description below if you have a Gen 6 or are you planning to get one or are you looking for the Pixel Watch? 
I still prefer the Gen 6 because it is still more customizable. You can customize the buttons where with the Pixel Watch you can't. It, the bezels is about the same either way. This one is a bit more obvious with the bezels here, which is kind of big. But with the Pixel Watch, it does blend to the corners. So if you do want that, go for that. But currently, the Gen 6 is slightly cheaper than the Pixel Watch. And you get more options. Your choice. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.